Good morning. Oh, I haven't done a video in a while and I kind of feel like I'm out of the loop. Like when you're doing them every week, it's, you know, it just becomes like a routine. And then when you have some time off, um, just, yeah, it feels weird. It feels a bit weird. Anyway, we are currently heading down south and I had a bit of a dilemma I'm like oh do I go to this place or this place or I don't know but I've looked at the weather and the weather's going to be hot so I've made a decision we're gonna head to Bustleton so I just I'm trying to get ready and I wash my face with a uh, warm washcloth of course um, yeah that who cares, right? Who care if I wash my face? I suppose you do, because you know, if you're not a, a not a vanner, then you're probably wondering, like, how do full-time vanners always clean themselves? We do bathe. Don't you worry about that. Sometimes, though, we just have to compromise with what we bathe in. Like, this is the size of my bath, and it's big enough. Like. For my feet <laughs> so I do have like a bigger bath in the front but it's full of like wood and Tonka's toys and bits and pieces so you know it's more difficult for me to get out so I generally get that one out when I'm gonna be camped up for a couple of days but otherwise I just use like the little bucket like that's enough but yeah like um, for those of you that don't know if you want to shower and stuff like most of the road houses have showers and they're all free. If you buy something from the roadhouse, ask them if you can use the shower. They're not always the cleanest, but you know, if you really need to have a shower, then that's where I go. If not, I bathe in my van. So, I'm not a dirty girl. But anyway, we need to get, <laughs> it's just like too much information. We need to get moving. I need to pack up the van and um, we are heading to Bustleton so I can do some food shopping because today is food shopping day. Don't move Tonka. Um, sun visor broke so I've pulled it out and I need to find a new one of these hook things so I'm hoping that along my travels I'm gonna either see a car wrecker or something so at the moment I'm holding my <laughs> my blind up with a bit of wood <laughs> we're funny aren't we Tonka hey we do some weird stuff now. Yeah. Oh, I turn the egg on off. The car starts perfect every time now. Where are we going? Tonka? Where are we going? Hey, where are we going?
The beaches here are so pretty and there's heaps of like little sections that you can take the dog and yeah, there's heaps of people at cafes and that with their dogs and like it's just a really neat tidy little town and they have so much space if you want to have a picnic or heaps of parking too so it's quite a big town really when you think about it i need to find out some more things about bustleton other than just the jetty and i need to do some food shopping i think i need to get that done before it gets too hot veggies, some apples, mango, nectarine, peaches, potatoes, capsicum, and healthy licorice, and only one block of chocolate, and the all-important coconut oil. So these legs don't brown on their own. Yeah. And these bags, I got these from like Ikea and they had like a set of two for like $7.99. Like these are the best to hang. I just hang mine on a hook. And it's my fruit basket. And I treated myself to some soaps. Now I put these in my containers of where my clothes are and then my clothes smell absolutely delicious when I get them out to wear them. Done. So we're just going to head into town and have a bit of a look around now that the shopping and everything's done and then We'll head to the beach a little bit later and Tonka can go for a swim. Beach Trail and I think oh, I don't know it's about six k's out of um, 
Bustledon, like heading towards Bunbury. And it's just like a little pullover side so you can go to the beach. It's a dog friendly beach. There's not many houses here and it's so quiet. Like I was the only one parked here last night. The weather here has been like super hot, around 38 degrees. My fridge has not coped at all. It's just been draining the battery, trying to stay cool. We're trying to stay cool. But today is meant to be about 35 and then tomorrow is going to be about 27, 28 I think they said because they're expecting showers today. But we're going to pack up anyway and we're going to head a little bit inland because there's a few little hiking trails that I really want to check out. So Bustleton I'd have to say the main attraction for sure, definitely the, the ocean side. It's just so, so pretty. Um, and and clean like they clean the beaches and oh, we've just had a lovely couple of days and yeah I, I'll definitely be back here oh, this is my second time back here in a month <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed uh, my video don't forget to hit subscribe and thank you to all of those that are supporting me and I'm sorry if it does take a little bit of time to get back to you um, with your questions We've got ants biting my feet, annoying Tonka. So yeah, we need to pack up and go. Yeah.